Hello and welcome to Welsh Ryan Arena for this Big Ten women's basketball matchup between the Iowa Hawkeyes and the Northwestern Wildcats. Two teams separated by just one game in the Big Ten standings. I'm Brandon Liebhaber alongside my partner John Rosenberg. So Prinny goes inside, finds Alexander. Now outside, here's Walleen. Nice pass inside. Now back out to Alexander who knocks down a three and Iowa takes a five to two lead. Now she crosses the timeline. Jeske with a fadeaway and she knocks it down. Fry with it on the elbow. Now Walleen has a three blocked by Maki. Northwestern in transition. Here's Brittany Orban up over Brittany and in. And the Wildcats with a double digit lead, 20 to nine. Northwestern had been dominating in the early going. They were on a 19 to two run before Kelly Cry hit this three pointer to get Iowa back to 12 points. But the Hawkeyes trailing by 14, Northwestern really all over a team that they're trailing in the Big Ten standings. Good to see them come out with this kind of intensity. Traveling violation on Trisha Nesbitt, the backup guard from Ames, Iowa. 3.42 left in the first half, timeout on the floor. We will take it as well as you look at Amy Jeske give the Cats a 13 point lead here at Welsh Ryan Arena. Under two minutes to go in the half, Marshall takes an off balance jumper, misses, but Diamant there for the rebound. She's double teamed, puts it up, and somehow gets it to go in. What a shot by Danielle Diamant. Well, shot clock's been turned off. Inside to Jeske with eight seconds left. She misses a turnaround. Fight for the rebound is won by Iowa. Alexander gets it away to Prinny. Two seconds left, throws it up from half court, and it is no good. So we go into halftime. Northwestern in this big matchup with an 11 point lead over the Iowa Hawkeyes, 34-23. You are watching the Big Ten Network. We're gonna take a break for halftime, but we'll be right back for the second half of action. It should be good. Misha Reed with a dribble. She pulls up and cannot get the bounce. That thing hit the rim three times before Kashin Alexander pulled down the rebound for the Hawkeyes. There's a hustle play by Orban. She knocks it out of bounds, cannot save it. She dove on the floor right in front of us. Orban just goes all out 100% of the time. Northwestern tries to answer on the other end. Marshall thought about a three, finds an open hackney for three, and she knocks it down. Northwestern answers an Iowa three with one of their own from the sophomore, Kendall Hackney. Out of bounds, ball will stay with Northwestern. Under 16 minutes to go, timeout on the floor. We'll take it as well. Northwestern starting to lose some of that momentum. They lead 41-36. You're watching the Big Ten Network. Walleen thought about taking another three, takes it inside, off balance. Shot is good, off the backboard and in for Camille Walleen. And all of a sudden it's a one possession game. This Iowa contingent very much in this game. Northwestern with it, here's Reed, finds Orban. Orban in the corner, inside to Cheski. immediate double team. She tries to find an open, Marshall passes tipped and stolen by Cry. She goes all the way, the left-handed layup is good and Iowa takes the lead. So Northwestern with it, down by five, finds Jeske, she's got range and she knocks it down. I thought this was a basketball game, but it's turned into a three point shootout, John. Iowa with the ball coming out of the timeout. Here's a three point attempt by Prinny, it's good. And Iowa has taken their biggest lead of the game, an eight point advantage for the Hawkeyes, 61-53. Things going from bad to worse for the Northwestern Wildcats. Everybody getting in on the action for the Hawkeyes. That time, Kelsey Cermak, who's averaging less than three points a game, gets three on one shot right there. Here's Alexander, who makes the shot and gets fouled. What a play by Kasheen Alexander. 16 points now for her, a chance to add another. Amy Jeske gonna get called for the foul. We are gonna take a break. 68-58 Iowa, your score from Welsh Ryan Arena. You're watching the Big Ten Network. Northwestern in need of a miracle right now. Final minute of play. Here's Beth Marshall trying to orchestrate things for the Cats. She takes a three and she banks it in. Apparently the banks open on Sunday as Marshall commits the foul. Northwestern just will not go away. So Cry hits the free throw and Iowa is pulling away. The Iowa contingent here at Welsh Ryan can breathe a sigh of relief. Their Hawkeyes were down by as many as 13 in this one, but they had a heck of a second half. 
They've now scored 62 points in the second half of play. That's almost as much as they average in a game. Here's Reed, gives it off to Hackney. Three-pointer at the buzzer is no good. And that will do it from Welsh Ryan Arena. The Iowa Hawkeyes come in and give Northwestern just their fourth home loss of the season. Iowa improves to 19 and seven on the year. Seven and six in conference. Northwestern suffers a tough loss. That'll do it from Welsh Ryan Arena. Once again, Iowa with an 86-75 win. I'm Brandon Liebhaber saying goodbye for my partner, John Rosenberg. This was a broadcast of the Big Ten Network.